Hi there, I'm Andrew, and today I'm going to be doing a video on the T-Mobile HD2 uh, updated ROM. Um, T-Mobile has released a new ROM this um, I think it's the beginning of this month. I'm not sure um, if I'm correct. It's um, version 314.531.1. Um, um, I just freshly installed it, so um, right now the time is not correct. Um, I'm gonna up. I'm gonna change that. Um, I'm in New York. Um, the time is now in New York. It's 4:11 p.m. Um, Sunday, October 24th, 2010. Um, the reason for, for 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 this video is I've searched YouTube trying to gain information whether I should update to the um try this new version or not and there's no videos. I've even searched the X the X the developer forms um under the T Mobile H D two section or um RAM RAM development and they didn't really have any uh video nobody know them everybody was scared to try it so me being the asshole I am because I am an asshole said so I'm gonna go in uh and and, and, tr and try it out on my phone uh and give a feedback on it now to get the time set right after launch I have to do internet time sync which I'm doing right now and then I launch the weather app and I have to do an update under weather which will um, update the time as well. Uh, okay, um, but basically, this ROM is like any of the other stock ROMs. The Mobile HD2 is a very good phone overall. There is a few bugs wrong with it, you know, but um, there is room for improvement in this. Um, but uh doing this will update your your radio version to 215 um, right now my f my phone is um hard spl i use hsp I, I use hspl3 to root my phone and before when i when i did that a while ago i also updated my radio version to 212 as well but now when i install this version of the um it, um of this of this new ROM uh, it, it it updated my uh, radio version as well. So, now that being said, I'm gonna try it with Android before the early the other versions of um of the of the um Android <coughs> the, the older version of of uh, Androids they didn't work with with the stock ROMs. It didn't work. Uh, I I actually launched. They said it will break if you do it, but I tried it personally and it didn't. It didn't break my phone. The only difference is the song didn't come out right. The song glitchy. It sounded like um like a robotic voice. So, so I I and I, I ended up switching back to switching to a stock ROM. Um. Now you have to launch Claret EXE first, but. They, they they will tell you if you look on the web they'll tell you that it's n it's not supposed to do anything but in the stock ROM it, it acts as you you know publisher or known publisher you, do you want to take the risk yes or no uh, with respect yes there's almost every program you install it tells you that if it's not from the um, marketplace so um, go ahead and press yes the Herod EXE usually doesn't act with that either but in the stock ROMs it does now here it's launching I'm launching this for the first time on the stock ROM so let's see <coughs> so far so good it's launching launched like it's supposed to be launched okay <coughs> oh now there's one thing I do to add in the Android it um, actually the version of Android I'm using is Freo 2.2 Darkstone um, Darkstone series 3.2 which was released October 17th of this year um, which was only a few days ago and um, version 3 the, the, pre the previous versions of the 
of the PPPs, um, the connection would uh, drop all the time, the, the internet. So, especially when I'm at work, the internet drops a lot. And there's one thing that's still occurring with what, any Android, well, only the PPPs that so far. Um, um, when I'm at work in the basement, the um, my reception is, is gone in the basement but on the windows it I, I have reception is low I only have like one or between one and two bars it bounces but I can still call and text and stuff like that but and serve the web but on the Android I can't do anything there's can't there's no reception is it sometimes there's an X on the bar or sometimes the bars just there's no bars on there at all it's just a, a, a gray bar the bars are just grayed out hopefully they fix that like they did everything else and uh, hopefully they fix the camera the, the the zoom doesn't work. I've tried the zoom and it doesn't work. But I really don't use my camera app. Only if I'm using um quick to make videos and stuff like that. I use my phone. That that they're pretty much clear. But um that's about it. Ho hopefully they fix those issues. Oh and, and um you cannot send a SMS, no picture video, no picture message, voice messages. Um, I was able to before I had had um, a a PPP patch, which allowed me to send um, video um, videos and picture matches and stuff like that. But um, I, I I lost the app and I cannot find it anymore. So I don't I cannot send it. I, I really don't send it. I just wanted to, to make sure have everything up and run running correctly. But hey, better than those right now. The web is much better, better, rich experience in the web. I have a custom background that's not what comes in, um, launch when you first install it. Um, I think I basically covered almost everything. And there we go, as you can see, everything is working fine. There we got the touch flow. Well, it's now called senses. You got the senses with the weather, weather moving around and everything. Um, this one doesn't freeze like the previous versions. It's pretty smooth. Um, everything works pretty fine f for me, except you know, except for this the issues I've uh, explained to you earlier. Um, but besides that, everything works fine. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um. So, okay, so as you can see, the scrolling is very smooth. It's no um, no glitching like before with freeze. Everything works. Scroll very fine. Okay, um, you can see everything. All the everything is there. I did have to install the file manager. It wasn't there. Skyfire works pretty great in here. Seeing that I install um, Flash 10, so now everything works pretty pretty fine. Um, I can watch videos on any website, except for Hulu. Still can't watch videos on Hulu, but it, um, everything works fine. Um, everything works fine. Now while recording this video, I forgot to um put to to let you guys hear the um the sound of the um of the phone call so um to test the phone to see if it works uh, so I will do that now I can tell you it did work I was just speaking to my girlfriend on it and uh, it's pretty fine everything works pretty smooth um I even recorded a video right after I, I did this one so it works pretty pretty fine, I can tell you that for sure. But I'll play a little sample of the um, audio right now by calling my voicemail. And I'll put it on speakerphone. Anybody here? Please enter your password. Then press pound. Sorry, five, 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 five. It's not a valid password. And the website is, sorry, I don't have the website queued up right now.